Hello, everyone. It's video game time. I am the yeah. man known as Darren. Yeah, yeah. I live on the right hand side of the screen. There's another guy. He lives on the left hand side of the screen. What is your name? Other guy. I'm Darren. It's Boo. Brandon. <laughs> Boo. Boo. Aww. Okay. Okay. I'm not that much of a bad guy. I just like to joke around a little bit. Uh huh. Uh-huh. You are a real joker. Yeah. So, uh, Darren uh, buzzes me up today and says, Hey, uh, you want to play some 64? And I'm like, you bet I do. And he's like, well, it's time for some sin and punishment. And I'm like, well, New Year, I deserve it. Lord knows I've been bad. And he's like, no, sin and punishment. And if you're as perplexed as I am, then... I guess we're in the same boat because I've never heard of this. Why haven't I heard of this, Darren? Uh, well, it was a Japan-only release, so that probably has something to do with it. It was released over here on the Wii Virtual Console. Wow. Okay, so we're going to play some bizarre Japanese stuff. And just watching the screen, I can tell you, it's definitely... definitely unusual for me. Yeah. I don't see Everything, what's so unusual about it. Just, I don't know. It just feels so Final Fantasy X2, which <laughs> okay. I would know nothing about because I never played that game. So that's the, aren't they like pop singers or something in that game? I don't I don't see any pop singers going on here. Honestly, look at my side of the screen. That person looks like they're doing a little pop song and dance right there. Okay, they're yeah. Standing sideways, looks shooting like, they like that. Could... Like, we could start moonwalking at any second. They're upside down, so their boots must be grafted onto the ship or something. Like, how does that work? <laughs> like, how did to... just punched a missile? They're they're hitting a missile with a sword. Makes sense to me. <laughs> That's how yeah, you take you care know? of missiles. Has anyone tried it before? <laughs> Uh, yeah, I'm pretty sure I tried it in D&D, &D, like, a ton of times, and they were just like, no, you don't get to samurai sword a missile. That's yeah. not how, it's not how the world works. I mean, how, do you, how do you know that's not how, has anyone tested that in real life? Science says that you have to test your hypothesis. So I say until someone tests hitting a missile with a sword, 100% possible to end. Huh. Well, I'm going to forego common sense and just go with it on that. Yeah. We live in the world we we live in a world of the rule of cool. Can you no longer hear me? Well, let's play this this thing. Um, can you hear the music in the background to dear listeners because it is pretty wild stuff. Hopefully they can. Let me see. I'll turn up the volume on my end. And let's see if I can hear it. Oh, yeah. Yeah, no, it's audible. Yeah, it's audible. So, yeah, we're playing a game that's a Japanese-only release until somewhat recent years. And uh, that's cool because you get to experience some culture, you know? You get to see what, what the 64 meant to other people in different places, which is very cool. Indeed. So I noticed that the difficulty set to easy off the go, being that we are slow, slack-jawed uh, Western, uh, Westerners, we should probably leave it there. Probably. Uh, so start game, I guess? Start game. Wow. Okay, I'm immediately getting some upskirt action. Um, running through a field, shooting a gun. And I gotta say, right out the gate, this game is freaking awesome. It this is really enjoyable. Listen to that soundtrack. I'm gonna shut up for a second so you can hear it. Man, that's awesome. I think we're like doing pest control. We're basically Monsanto, I think. Yeah. 
This is uh, Monsanto. Like you run through the fields and you get rid of all the pests. This is what happens when you uh, you let the Germans GMO all the bugs. Oh no! For super powerful German bugs. Get bonus. Oh, the sound effects are cool. You got English voices. How does that happen? I thought this is a Japanese release. Yeah, that happens sometimes. Games will be like they'll have they'll they'll, they'll all the voices will be in English, but it just never came out here for some reason. It's not the only game that's like that. Some of these bugs are very gross. My uh, cousin Adam once told me something that I thought was so funny. He says that he actually dislikes dead bugs more than live bugs because dead bugs don't run away when they're near you and then you have to touch them or something. I always thought that was really funny. Mm, yeah, that's an interesting perspective. Yeah. So touching bugs is gross. But <laughs> it seems a very complicated position to hold. Indeed. Wow, this game's really fun. I gotta say, it's uh, it feels like it's like an arcade game that you like insert quarters into or something. Yes, it's definitely pretty arcade. Yeah, it feels like like she shouldn't be walking though. She should be like I don't know, driving a car or a hover bike or something. Uh huh. But walking, you know, we don't have enough walking shooters where you're just like. Just taking a stroll through a cornfield and being like, I hate bugs. This person prefers dead bugs over live bugs, clearly. Evident. Yeah. Have you tried pushing a button other than the Z button yet? Uh, well, R jumps. Oh, you can jump? You can jump. Oh, my God. And then A seems to switch between a lock on and a not on the, and do your kind of free roam. Oh, nice. I caught I caught in the in the little tutorial that was happening as we were waiting for the game as we were waiting for the stream to start that when you're in lock on mode you do less damage. Oh, that makes sense. Saki. No, I totally Saki. agree, Rai guy. This is definitely at the Good arcade morning, at a theater Saki. for sure. Good morning, Iron. Wow, I'm so surprised that there's so much English in this. Like the voices, like someone. And the accents are good too. Come on, we've got work to do. Oh, now we're in the pop band. All right. Yep. Take that construction equipment. Well, the storyline is really rich too. You know, it's like I got, first I worked for Monsanto. <clears throat> Now I'm very disappointed at this construction crew. They're not getting their work done fast enough. So time to burn it down. That's right. All right, girls, let's go. Oh, can you move? Oh, you can move left and right, dude. Oh, shit, yeah, okay, the C buttons. Oh, this is so cool now. So you can jump and you can move left and right. So you can like dodge and shoot. Oh, this game just got so much cooler. Oh, we got ninjas. Take, care of it, Take the ninjas down. <laughs> Take that, ninjas. Guitar solos going off. This game's awesome. The graphics are like, there was an intro sequence where there was uh, an alarm clock and it was like super good. They're like PlayStation 1 graphics, but with a little bit of spice in there. This part reminds me of Contra. I have to, like, have to shoot the wall. Oh, schnip. I had to go through fire. Can you... Can I teabag? That's a better question. Can you teabag? Already? Look at these dumb things. They're just. I get to stand like a K pop star and just. Oh, that's a big one. Oh, that's a big one. I'm gonna let all the little guys go because I know what it is. Ooh, 
For ninjas, this guy, this is a freaky guy. He's trying to cut me out. But he can't seem to hit you if he sidestep. Man, the guitar solo is just right. What the fudge? Are you a transformer? Uh, no, I'm still fighting this one. Get bonus. Where'd they come from? Iron, cover our backs. Aha! They can't shoot you if you stand directly in front of them. Freaking awesome. Man, they move like scary robots. Yeah, this game's pretty cool. Pretty cool. Yeah. It, the artwork is totally not up my alley, but I can appreciate <laughs> what they're doing. Come on, quick, into Shinjuku Station. Hurry! It's an intentional choice to, to like attacking. make it this way, you know? Yeah, I can get that. There, that should get the elevator moving. Do you think they're onto us? Maybe, but they're probably more worried about the. Man, road. that guy with the noob tube doesn't know what he's doing. I he's got to go back to Halo love. school. I'll he... check it out. Just keep the elevator moving. Top. Oh, more knives, guys. area there'll be some red items on the ground they're not items they're actually grenades so oh, okay good to know they, they look like items though they're really long, yeah. oh yeah up and down Hit diagonally, that's bad. I wasn't expecting that. Oh, I'm gonna run out of time? Oh man. You gotta beat him before you run out of time. Oh, oh that super sucks. Oh man. Brutal. The time is out. Oh, when you run out of time, your life just starts depleting. Oh, okay. That super sucks. Oh, I did it. Ooh, I just My did life it. Is you too? Uh, I, got, I oh, just did it before the time ran out. <laughs> oh, but look at my life. Oh, oh boy. I know. You are in the shit. I am definitely in the shit. Hey, is that life? Oh, that is life. Need it. Dead bugs are gross. The transport. Iron, take the control. Hurry, Stocky! Uh. Whoa! Hold on! 
Oh, you can walk off the cliff. Oh. Yikes. <laughs> Man, I'm doing like no damage to this guy. Is there a secret? Man, I'm getting my ass beat. What's your secret? Uh, if you sword him in the head, he takes a lot of damage. You can use a sword? Oh, yeah. When you get close to stuff, you can sword it. How? Oh. You just, when you get close, it just auto, and you tap Z, it does a sword. Are you tapping Z or just holding it? I hold it when I'm shooting the gun, but when I want to sword someone, get up there and tap. Okay, I'm trying, I'm just dying. Oh, there we go, I did it once. And I'm dead. Hey, you're a different character than me. Oh, really? That's weird. Well, I got deaded. Yeah, I pushed him off the cliff. Oh, <laughs> he shit. pushed him off a cliff, he takes big damage. Please continue. You gotta push him off the cliff, man. You got to. That's how you do Got him. Woo! Did you know you can jump in the air? Well, like you can double jump? Yep. Okay. Oh, I'm a male. I thought I was a... That's fine. Okay, there is some very, very strange stuff happening. It's raining men. I don't know what happened here. I was doing like pretty good that first time, and then I died, and now the second time, he just like, he's just like, nah. <laughs> yeah, I really struggled my first time, and then the second time it was easy. So, hang in there, homeboy. We'll get it. Your advice about the sword really helps. Whoa. Oh no. Oh no, don't die, gal. She's doing a lot of weird convulsing, and she ate some bad fish. Okay. These graphics are so dizzying <laughs> when the buildings are moving and stuff. It's like, oh, man. It's just like I ate some bad fish. <laughs> oh. What is going on? What? I'm drowning in blood now. Okay, now oh I'm blood ocean. Okay. Uh, like, honestly, as an outsider, like, trying to follow the story, I, uh, I can't even get close. There's, like, a pair of eyeballs that talk and planets that are flying around and bugs in space and... I am. I'm finding a hard 
time giving a care to any of this because what is happening mm -hmm. but the feeling is very intense and it's fun so i'm I think I'm able to get around that, but I'm also very like, what the fudge is going on? Okay, there we go. I right, got. Nice. I uh, killed the gal, and I'm on this big scary thing. I'm in Blood Ocean. My research yeah. materials. How could you? So you're the leader of these killers. Can't you all stop? He's one of the rebels. Let me take him. He's only human. Now's our chance to test the power of the blood you gave me. There, I killed the big guy. Whoa, look, I'm not even me anymore. I'm a, I'm a weird creature. Yeah, I'm kind of, I'm kind of something. And I'm surfing like this blood ocean. Guitar solos just keep going. I'm not even really sure what I'm shooting at. I know my life is dropping. I know this enemy's on his like fifth health bar. Oh, I think I got him. Yep. There we go. You go in blood ocean. What the heck is going on now? What the fudge? I'm in a computer. I'm falling asleep. I'm in blood ocean again. They just said a, a curse word. A child just swore on the screen. This is... Uh, what is going on? So, up until now, I think most of the storyline was, like, comprehensible, but now that you're in, like, the blurry, like, buildings, moving things, like, now I'm talking yeah. to Metal Gear. Yeah, it kind of look like that, yeah. <laughs> you just drowned? Yep. Yeah, this escalated quickly. Yeah, <laughs> it really did. <laughs> At my screen, there's an Axel Quaddle that's talking in English. He's got the voice of a baby. Okay. Also notice that you're not human anymore. Yeah, there's some kind of weird humor jigger. It's almost like they took a full-blown story that was already hard enough for Westerners to understand and then just cut out all of the critical sense in between. I feel like I'm changing channels and every channel is a different manga. And I, <laughs> I might have been able to possibly figure out the gist of one of them, but it keeps changing. That's a pretty good dodging you're doing there. There you go. Okay, so my boy just changed into a girl. That's cool. I'm there. You know, Japan's ahead of its time. I'm into that. I'm into that. Yep. If only it were that easy. If only it were Sailor Moon style. Just do a spin, change your clothes, boom. Sadly, no. Music is Fuck. Did you get deadered? Deadered. Oh, hang in there, homeboy. Please this is continue. cool. This is like a 3D puzzle now. Oh, yeah. Yeah. You can walk around. 
There's an Axel Coatl who chases you in the middle. Oh man, he's sending some fuzzies. He's got HP. He's got a lot of HP. He's gotta keep spinning. Get out of here, eyeballs. Oh, got me again. It's a hard fight. Please continue. I'm gonna run out of time. This sucks. You have to fight us. Uh, I call him an Axel Coatl. It's hard because all he does is runs away. And he's got so much freaking life. Looks like Star Fox on steroids. It is a little bit like Star Fox. Did, I, what, um, what, did, did you but, figure out how to dodge that like big blood wave? It seems like that there's no way to dodge that. I just took it on the chin like yeah. a champ. Um, I do have some advice for you though. So that boss has got four phases. I believe. Um, the first phase super sucks. Uh, but if you just keep timing your jumps and moving left and right, you can dodge most stuff while just continuously shooting the center right of the enemy. Um, when you get to the second one called Hiding Karuna or whatever, um, just move left or right, don't bother jumping. And uh, aim for that little clip in the top middle, that little yellow head ball there. Um, uh, what else can I say? Yeah, just keep shooting at that thing, move left and right, don't bother jumping. Yes, and, uh, uh, the third form is the hardest one, which also sucks because they're helping me. But, yeah, that's what I can really say. It was a close fight for me. So, I don't know how much of the soundtrack the uh, viewers can uh, hear, but it's pretty awesome. Um, you have surprisingly a lot of control of your character. Like, you can't really change a lot of your speed, but you can move left or right. And in my place, it's like fully three Oh, boy. There we go. Um, you got him? Got him. Nice. Oh, you'll be happy to know I'm like way is that, having trouble with this. Is next that Zock? You can change him back, okay? Just not now. We're the only ones left. Everyone else is dead. Damn it! Oh no! <laughs> it's just. Oh, oh wow. okay. They survived. Like, damn, just killed the other two protagonists here. I suck at this. I'm out of time again. Cut you up. I understand your feelings, Brad. Kachua was a good match for you, both militarily and emotionally. But I can't lose you too. Retreat. Died again. No hope for Japan. There's an enemy out there. A monster. I won't let it run free. Yeah, things get even more confusing very quickly. I lost Kachua. 
Now it's Achi's turn to lose something. <laughs> Thinking of revenge. Like <laughs> Radon, Kachua, the women I passed my blood to. That little thing they? that's talking to you, Achi, you have to fight him I'm next. Going to and show he the super sucks. Okay. Really is. Just telling you now, like, start hating him early. This is the safest spot. It's the armed volunteer ship. Attention, attention. Our defense of Tokyo has failed, but we shall remain in Japan to battle this new beast. Beast? Its target is a ruffian lair in Hokkaido. By eating ruffians, it will strengthen. By assimilating them, it will threaten humanity. Redon eating ruffians? As your commander, I urge you to find the courage to engage this beast. Him! So he's their commander! Die. I can't figure out uh, what I'm doing wrong here. I have to like. Get bonus. This person just stands like a four amp. Did you get past it finally? I did. It was hard. Did you get past it? I'm working on it. I just kept running out of time. That's death. What's up, Banjo? Got a Banjo Kazooie on the screen. Busted? Oh no, you made it. Yeah, oh, I you did. made it on but, your first try. Yeah, there was like a health pickup, and it was in front of me. But then the character turned, and it wasn't in front of me anymore, so I didn't get oh, it picked yeah. up. I had that. There's a couple of those.
least they have a hit bar. Like they even have. Oh, fall. Yeah, that double jump is really necessary for the next part. Yeah, it's wow, what a great. You figured out before it's a double jump. Oh, yeah. Yeah, definitely arcade of a movie theater vibe. Yes, very, very arcade. Oh boy, this guy. I know! Especially after I lost to him like so many times in a row. Yes! Woo! There's load. I could have just teleported free? What? What are they talking about? Get bonus. Traps were for ruffians? Oh so my god. Watching this always makes me feel like... I'm the dumbest kid in class because I have no idea what's going on. Like, was I not here? I was paying attention. I was here since the first level, but nothing makes sense. <laughs> this this game is totally insane. Yeah. I don't, uh... No damage. Hey. Beat him. Look out, friend. Don't die. Dangerously close. Yeah, I know. This is just... It's been tough. And I died. <laughs> okay, so a kid transformed into a beast. This guy and that gal. And this gal. Now we got research for transformation. Okay, we killed his dog. Yes, we're changing Saki into a human. Oh, my arm really hurts. What the heck is going on? I kind of feel like maybe Japan hasn't like fully uh, healed from the trauma that was Hiroshima when I see things like this. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> They're still working some stuff out. You know, I'm like fighting fighter planes and talk about all of Japan being exploded and stuff. And right now I'm on a piece of rubble 
from an exploded plane that's falling through the air. But I'm like walking around on it, jumping on it, doing flips. This is a... Uh... I am too old and crotchety to have any fun. This is just so bizarre. Oh, got him. Good jab. Oh yeah, this is the part where you get to freaking oh, yeah, this is board those missiles. Sword those Don't missiles. You yeah. how I mean, you could just shoot them, but I feel like sorting them is cooler. They're dangerous. They're about to kill me. These enemies outmatch you, Leda. They're all that remain with Hachi and her followers. It's quite possible that the girl oh, has inherited you get when you're that annoying. You try this to kill time, them. I will face them. Better, you might as well learn this now. You yes. must stay back. That's just part of life. Well, Commander, now I'll avenge my friends. The pleasure will be all mine. Well, Commander, if that is your doing. Sometimes I want him to get close, so I can use the sword. Uh-oh. Attack helicopters. They don't appear to be killable. On these ones. I'm not through yet. Take this, volunteers. Yeah, I feel sorry for these guys. Like, I never expected to be taken out, Mr. Military Guy. You know, crushed by a transgender hero with a single pistol. Uh huh. That never needs to reload. Like, I'm uh, I'm pretty much upside down. But uh I don't know, I must uh must weigh like nothing at all, like a fly or something. Get a bonus. I'm not yet. Oh, mash the buttons. Mash the buttons as fast as you can, there. Just mash that as fast as you can. Okay. I thought there was, like, more of a timing element to it. It might be, but I just mashed it and it worked. not falling down how am I not falling down like look at this <laughs> he's got magnet boots strange powers strange powers indeed it seems Achi has taught you nothing my powers were given you're to a me strange by Achi. animal I, Achi I am passed upside her down. blood to me the it's same uh, goes for that kid okay, who transformed into the beast don't question it, Saki is nothing like you. This is a piece of art. I never thought you'd try don't, to make friends by snob. passing your blood. Perhaps not friends. Perhaps research for your transformation. Change can be a scary thing when you, you don't like know the sound how to change when you back. Shoot the guys, they're like, oh, oh, they sound like Michael Jackson grunting. I ran. Do you want to change Saki <laughs> back into a human? Oof. Watch out! All fighters away from the flagship. What? The floor! If they attack Saki from the air, then we'll need this. <laughs> I know, right? 
right? So glad you're here to feel the. What the? All fighters break apart. Incredibly dumb. Just like, hey, we're gonna we're gonna need the floor of this room that we're in. <laughs> yeah, just get this floor out and let's go flying. All right. That's hap that happened, I guess. <laughs> These things get real explodey pretty quick. Okay. I'm so upside down. Am I actually on a plane? I thought I was on a piece of wreckage, but... Yeah, no, you're definitely just on a piece of wreckage. <laughs> <laughs> Alright. Definitely some trauma. Yeah, a little bit. A little bit. So when you um, slash those missiles with your sword, they actually turn around and fly wherever your target is. That's how you destroy the helicopters, because you can't actually kill the helicopters. But you can send the missiles after the helicopters and they will take them down. You're welcome. Yeah, thanks for the scoops. Yeah, man. Whoa, that spacey check was standing next to me the whole time. Oh, they're surfing on one too. You see, they're no seatbelts or anything. That's cool. I get it. The construction, you know, I think these things are sometimes a little ridiculous too. Yeah, I'm not gonna fall. You think I'm an idiot? You think I'm an idiot? Like I'm just gonna fall off of this spaceship that's flying around super fast in the air like that? Maybe. I'm not a dummy. I wouldn't do that. Up. Yeah, it's definitely a little piece of wreckage. Yeah, it is, it is. So long, gay Bowser. So long, gay Bowser. Crying Brad's name. Yeah, who's Brad? Uh, was, was that the guy that had the pet weird animal thing? With the baby voice, I think? Come back to me if you want friends. Oh, there goes a lot of atom bomb again. And uh, the soundtrack is just unhinged. Like, it's just guitar solo. Like, here you go, have fun. We'll just drop you a pound of blow and all the guitars you want. Yeah, they're just wailing. Wow. 
here. Ooh, the U.S. Army. U.S. Army makes an appearance. Oh, no way. Those guys. Wow. Okay, maybe there really is a Hiroshima thing going on. I sure hope they don't shoot down my plane. That would be unfortunate. My plane, my chunk of rubble that I have here. Yeah, this is pretty, uh, pretty neat though. It takes uh, forever. Yeah, this is definitely like the longest level. You gotta get the time pickups or you won't make it. Oh yeah. So how is this piece of rubble flying around like this, and how are we staying on it? The answer, here we go. Like, you yeah, can't like this crisis. Blood, blood magic. <laughs> they keep talking about blood and giving people blood, so I'm going with blood magic. I got better. Oh man, you don't want to restart that level. Continue. Let's see where. Okay. Keeps me going from this part. Oh, that's good. Yeah. I'm glad this game in 2000 was smart enough. Yeah. Not to uh, make you make a That would Here be. Here we go. Nice. You will get us through this crisis. You're exactly right, right? Um, no, you're right. Like, it's rare that we suffer at long times for like a shitty game. Um, unless like maybe we feel like we're gonna beat it now or something redeeming. Yeah, like um, that time when we finished power, or I finished power. <laughs> yes, yeah, which we gave a one. That's a good example. Um, but this game, there's so much I don't know what the F is going on. Like, at the first level, it felt like I was at the end of the game. 
And so I just don't even know what's happening. Yeah, when you hit that blood ocean, that feels like a climactic final battle, but that's like the first 10 minutes of the game. <laughs> the whole game feels like Final Fantasy Advent Children. Like it, the thing's already over. <laughs> Look at them, they can't even escape. <laughs> <laughs> oh, the sounds are so funny. When you get dead, you're like, ah, I did. See these funny little words. Gosh, damn. There's credits, just like you're putting in real money. But the real money is... to see him fight the ruffians and Saki. To humans, our power is an object of either hostility or worship. I guess Brad just didn't want to be hated by mankind. What a weird camera angle. Is that the U.S. Army? Oh, no, here we go. the weapons no, maker that backed Army. Brad Oh, really? So they're going on about human hearts and human forms, and it's funny because the graphics are so bad that they don't appear to look human. Look at that neck. Jeez Louise. I will open Saki's chest, you get his heart. They're talking about... I... I don't know... I believe Saki is the kid that turned into the monster that started coming to this first. Hey. Uh, false savior? <laughs> what the f Dude, the storyline. <laughs> the storyline so far. <laughs> I couldn't. Dude, I got a I got a hundred in astronomy. I can explain astrophysics way better than I can possibly explain this. Like I'm on a train in hell right now? How did I go from You were gone for 30 minutes and like I have no idea. This is yeah. co-op. Um this is not co-op. Uh this is uh two single player games played side by side. Uh and we're not very far apart. We're like maybe like four minutes different. Okay, now I'm in New York, America. Check it out. <laughs> All right. I'm in a subway in New York, America. Hell yeah. <laughs> this is actually, I've been on subways in America, and this is pretty much what they look like. After dark. Yeah, no, I don't think we'll be playing this for another hour, eh, Darren? Yeah, I doubt it. I'm, I think I'm even, I'm sorry, I don't think I would be finishing the game anyways, because I am running low on credits. Ah. Well, I'll put in a couple more quarters then, bro. Yeah. Sword, sword, sword. U.S. Army just has this crazy, like, space station airplane. <laughs> Whatever the hell this thing is. Um, so this person says, don't call me mommy. Uh, this is a very emotionally complicated game. About mommies and gender and the American military and turning into a human and all kinds of very complicated stuff. It, uh, I think the idea is kind of a Jordan Peterson kind of um, kind of a tactic. Just mention as many like meta uh, meta analyses and many uh, metaphorical topics as you can. Just be like, you know, it's like the archetypal hero who's um, got to compete all the demons that they have in inside themselves, and you know, change is a constant, and um, you know, that's uh. 
That's basically the question of life, man. And then just start crying. That's basically what this game is doing, I think. They're trying to uh, trying to appeal to a lot of complicated things through about five seconds of confused dialogue. And I'm left to deal with it. And then people ask me, what does this mean? What, what did I miss? Dude, there was no logical progression from one sentence to another in this whole game. I'll tell you right now. Nothing makes sense. But I'll tell you what is making sense. The gameplay is actually fun. Um, yeah. Gameplay is fun, and the soundtrack is shredded. Yeah, if you're into like people like kind of wanking off on guitar, then this is your soundtrack for sure. What is the bad guy? Aliens, humans, robots. My God, I don't know, dude. Uh, yeah, I don't know. What blood? What is the bat? What? There was a blood ocean. What? That looked pretty spec scary. Um, Brad? I'm gonna s probably the think... like Axel Coatl pet guy. He was. I didn't like him. Why are there crabs on the subway? Who put all these damn crabs in here? Can I jump on the crab? There you go. Yes. Oh, don't let the crabs overcome you. Oh, hey, it's the bad guy from the first level again. Oh, neat. He's here with crabs. He's starting crabs. to fire in the air in some way. Oh my god, whoa, they just launched a giant missile? That's targeting Saki. Oh no, Saki! I know, it gets good, Darren. Everybody watch along, see if you can follow this line of thinking. <laughs> Look at that facial expression. What? Have you ever played this game before? Uh, Wii Machine? This, this game is called Sin and Punishment. And I'm definitely feeling a little bit of sin and a little bit of punishment. Um, it's kind of really fun. And Ace Carlton, I'm glad that you created Wanking Guitar. I, I am your boy. Get bonus. Am I supposed to be scared? Hmm. We're still too I, early. The just feeling is mutual. Weakness would be bad. Is I am feeling very, We're just little very strange. He called a few people mommy already in this game. Hurry up and change him back to human form. And, uh, Saki's just forgetting his human heart. I mean... I'll believe it when I see it. Well, I think he's intentional. Japan's always like 10 years in the future, you know? I will open so chest. I think you in this heart. game they were Tell experiencing the transgender Thoughts, crisis. Memories, and, uh, hopes, dreams. Even as though this game was made in the year 2000, him, it's, uh, his humanity. it's basically made in the year 2020. Stop it! How can we do that? First, we must They're exploring some pretty deep no, concepts we can't do it. in this game. Just fire at Saki's forehead. Liar! False savior. Oh, okay. Just fire at his forehead. <laughs> yeah. Saki to stay this way? What, <laughs> what is this conversation? <laughs> <laughs> what's, the, what's there to not understand? I'm sorry. Oh, okay. I'm on the subway now. Now you're on the American subway. Where am I? On a train? Does this not make sense? Well, at least the character's as confused as I am. <laughs> yeah, that's like the only connection I've had to my character in the whole game. Was... Hey, what? You. Do you know where we are? We're on Long Island, aren't we? Long Island? New York? We're on Long Island? America? <laughs> Achi, where are you? Why did you do this oh, to nice. me? Well, Treasure is a fantastic uh, company for soundtracks, I'll tell you that. And they did not let me down. The soundtrack for this game is among some of the best ones I've heard in a while. In a long while. Good ones. Um, so, yeah. Uh, Treasure rocks, man. Um, so, Darren chose this game, and when I saw it, 
I knew right away that I'd be in for at least one kind of a treat. But as you can tell from like the game time, um, we've been playing this for a while. It's actually pretty fun. Um, I don't know what I'm doing on the American subway, fighting a thing of mashed potatoes that is uh, growing and getting closer to me every minute. That's what's going on, right? The mashed potatoes are getting bigger. I've never heard of Russians closer. invading America. <laughs> mommy, yeah, what are is? the monsters gone? Mommy. I, I know, mommy. mommy. That's what I said. Is this train out of control? So the potatoes are I gaining health. Car. Follow me. And they're getting bigger. So look yeah. out for that. Called birth model? Birth model. <laughs> 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 I hate it when my birth model gets out of control. Well, they did call him Mommy, so... Come on, birth model. Oh, there we go. I destroyed birth model. That was some work. Yeah. Uh... This story... This is probably, honestly, Darren, I'll tell you right now. This takes the cake. This is probably the most confused story I've ever witnessed in a video game. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, not wrong. This is pretty, I, pretty out there. I've heard, I've heard people on LSD make more sense than this. What? 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 If anyone's watching my screen, I hope you get there, Darren, because that is some strange, strange dialogue. Issa loves you, Mommy. Oh my god. <laughs> Thank you, Rye Guy, Fly Guy. <laughs> Story takes place in the near future of 2007 when war breaks out. Again, it's the American Japanese. Thing. As humanity is struggling with a global famine, the player takes the roles of Saki and Arian as they fight to save Earth from destruction. Okay. I pray that you get to the next part there. Okay, so. They're playing some creepy music, and they're making incisions into this thing's chest, and it's playing some very fun noises. <laughs> oh, I'm so sorry. Uh, Wee Machine is undergoing one of the hardest things we have to do, quitting smoking. So, I got a lot of respect for you, buddy, and you do what you gotta do. And I'm sorry that you have to suffer this. If anybody has successfully quit smoking, please say so in the chat. Oh man, there is some funny stuff going on in my screen. There's no end to them. Uh I'm what? What? I'm gonna let you watch with everyone else because it is too cool. Okay. Okay. 2017, 10 years into the future. You know what? I'm just gonna hit start and I'm gonna watch your screen and wait for you, okay? Alright. That is just too cool. No, this this is Let's all watch it together. Is it a warning to me? This isn't the future. You What's your name? Let's see if we can together, like, watch this and see if we can figure this out, okay? Issa and Amaya. I can even write it in kanji. Issa, uh, I'll remember that. We don't belong in this Together, future, we will Let's figure go. out just what the fuck is going on. Oh, you're not at the park yet. Yeah, okay. I guess I'm a bit further away than you thought. Yeah, it gets really good really soon. Uh, you're just a couple minutes away. I'll, I'll just play ahead a bit. All right. 
So hang in there, everybody. It gets peak level insanity. I do really like that you can like walk around left and right and you have a melee attack. That's cool. It's actually really simple that you can only switch between like two types of shooting. birth model. Don't get dead. Yeah, Don't ran out of time. Yeah, you're down to six credits. I still got 13. 13? Yep. What the f How <laughs> the fuck do you have 13? Yeah. I've been getting a lot of points. <laughs> wow, look at that booty on that character. Woo, what a frame. <laughs> what the heck? Oh man, look at the look at the hips on that character. What the fuck? That's so stupid. <laughs> what the? Fuck? I think my character's becoming pregnant throughout the course of the game or something. Like, I don't know what's going on. That Spider Man. Get dead, friend. I'm working on it. Yay. He's in the trash. Birth model? I gotta fight another birth model. We hate birth models, don't we, folks? Ah, uh, dead. Might I be able to offer you some advice? Sure. When, um, when you're fighting birth model and those little yellow balls come after you, uh -huh. um, you have to mash the Z button instead of holding it to swing your sword. And wherever, oh my God, we're eating people now. Oh yeah, we're eating people. Oh God. Uh, anyway, yeah, uh, mash the button to... Yeah, you're doing it. And you can use those yellow balls to kill the uh, the birth model faster. I see. Yeah. 
Just basically mash the Z button as fast as you can. Aim for the purple spot, of course, and you should be able to take it down faster. Just make sure you hit every yellow orb to speed up the process. Yeah, you're nailing it now, man. Yeah, it's weird. Oh, there we go. Wow. Great that information. Okay, now it's time for us to all follow along the story and see if we can make sense of what is going on. Okay, I'm going to need all your brains. Saki? That's right. Kay. I've taken this Hold form on. for you. We're in Achi's vision. Have you chosen your future? <laughs> Have you chosen your future? Don't go having a child. This is no future for children. You're wrong. Isa will live in a different future. Somewhere there's a future where I am your wife, Isa okay. is your son, and you are human. <laughs> Papa I am your wife, oh, says I'm the guy. Sorry. What do you think of your mom? Mommy's scary, but mommy's nice. Isa loves you, mommy. <laughs> and I love you, Isa. <laughs> That's why I know we'll see each other again. What the fudge? You just used a child. I should show you at least once. <laughs> You've only just finished the anesthesia. Okay. Now then. Now, twenty dollars to whoever can make sense of this. That's enough cutting. I'll do the rest. About Saki and Brad. Just what is your objective? My real enemies are very far away. Powerful enemies that have been fighting since long ago. Soon I'll end it with them, but I can't what? win with your current powers. This has all been mere training, simulation of a global war. You're crazy. You ruin Tokyo, we destroy the world too. Don't worry. You will ruin Tokyo. You took me on an American now subway. Now we're floating war. on an ocean. It will be Saki who uses his powers to bring that war to an end. He'll be feared, respected. His very figure, a symbol of command. Was Brad the same? He had the same <coughs> ultimate objective. Once he knew what the blood meant, his own plans took shape. He bred ruffians with his blood, writing and acting no! in his own order. He rushed to beat me to it. But I'm not impatient. <laughs> Saki must be a more powerful I know. Saki, what? <laughs> <laughs> Followed by Asaki, wake up. Shot to alarm clock. And if you're not confused, okay, so you haven't been paying heart. attention. Take back your own feelings. Someone with a straight face had to sit down to their boss and explain what they were planning with this game. <laughs> like, I can't even make movies this screwed up. <laughs> Ruffians? I, I've got to fight them. Deserted island. Saki. Look at the hips on that yeah, side. He's, he's, he's thick. thick he's boy. thick. That's what I was laughing about. <laughs> that guy is freaking packing. I think he's a mommy now. <laughs> I 
The Rye Guy Fly Guy did the hard work of actually doing the, reading the plot, and uh, yeah, it hasn't seemed to help them, so... Now I'm in a side-scroller uh, level, which is kind of cool. Oh, nice. Yeah, that's the thing. As, like, ridiculous as this game is, it's actually fun. Sin and punishment? More like confusion and anger on things not making sense. I don't know if anyone's watching my screen. This is freaking awesome. Like, oh, we're looking for that. Man, this game's fucking sweet. I love it. Just so wicked. Like, it's a fire breathing. It's basically a mini Godzilla, but I'm just sashing in the nads. Like, screw you. Take that. Hit him in the net. That's what you got. You know what? I'm gonna. I got Godzilla on my tail. Time to run. Woo. Back off, Godzilla. Uh oh. Uh oh. Godzilla is gonna breathe fire on you if you don't keep it going. Gotta use the sword. See? Plus one credit. If you get over 100 hits, they give you an extra credit. Hmm. Uh, apparently, I'm not good. Uh. Top, top, top. Uh. You're probably just playing different. Top, top. Yeah, uh. badly. <laughs> uh. Do you hold the button down? The fire button? Or do you oh, mash yeah. it? No, I hold it. I'm mashing it. Mashing. By mashing it repeatedly, you get to use your sword a lot more. And I think that's that's the trick. Though I am developing some kind of horrible cramp. Maybe because of my age. Or maybe that this game's doing it to me. I'm not sure. But uh, it's worth it. Yeah. I'm not uh, I'm definitely not doing any I'm not gonna be doing it. But uh it's probably easier to do the mashing on a regular N64 controller, which I'm not using. Oh, someone's not using a regular N64 controller. Yeah, this is new You hear that, bro? This has come up before. This is new I can't believe he's using non, non-canon controllers. This is what I have to compete with, folks. He's got an illegal advantage. Look, I had one, but it broke live on stream. <laughs> yeah, conveniently broke live on stream. I've heard that one before. Get bonus. Well, I have heard it before. It yeah, we But I have heard it before, Darren. That's right, you have heard it before. I have heard it before. You know what that sounds like? Sounds pretty, sounds pretty sus, as the kids would say. Sounds pretty sus. Oh, I got you. Yeah. yeah, I definitely see where, because I'm holding it most of the time, I think there's a lot more shit that you can reflect back that I'm not. Because here, like, I'm fighting this thing, and I'm like, okay, I'm just going to dodge these globs that he's coming at me with, and then I'm like, wait a minute. <laughs> oh, if you sort him, that goes way faster. So yeah, that's probably the problem. Check out my credits. Fuck off. <laughs> <laughs> this level is pretty cool, though. The one you're about to go to. Yeah. All of a sudden, things were. It's all got like uh, some platforming what elements, and it's got this some like Hokkaido, running from the enemy kind of stuff. It's cool. At least we won't go hungry. Really, First really good level. Spot. Challenging but fair. Right. The sun's about to set, so we'll keep watch here tonight. I wonder if Achi will follow us. You're I'm starting to consider maybe I will beat this dang game. I think she knows that. 
Yeah, there's a lot I want to ask Achi about this I mean, ugh, will it make sense in the end? Achi would... Definitely not. Let's go to America, Saki. Have I almost want to know what happens. The doctor can take care of it. <laughs> if they dissect me, it's over. They're close by. They must be on that road. I'll check it out. Wait here. You're tough, Saki. Oh no. Iron. Iron? Iron? Yeah, this is kind of, this is neat. This sort of different mode of gameplay here now. Mm-hmm. Yeah, they're switching it up. Like, they had one that was just straight up, like, shooter. Like, the American military one. But this one's more, like, running. Now I'm doing, like, a kind of a game of Buck Hunter. Except they're like, <laughs> yeah, these things are like unicorns or something instead, or uh, centaurs. Oh, it looks like there's another birth mother here. Damn birth mothers. Man Seamer. <laughs> what? <laughs> Look at the enemy's name. Man Seamer. <laughs> All right. Oh, another Man Seamer. Dang. I hate it when I get my Man Seamer out. These guys definitely look like they make Contra Hardcore. Is this game better than Rugrats? You better believe it. <laughs> So Rugrat, I think, was my number one worst game of 2020, 2022. Uh, 2021 was probably irritating stick. Off the top of my head, it was, that game was oh like made God. to be. Oh man, these pains, you probably. <laughs> Hang in there, buddy. <laughs> yeah, we don't have to fight. <laughs> We can we can call it quits if it's a <laughs> match. No, I, 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 this is hilarious. I love <laughs> yeah, the sound effects are pretty funny. Hey, look, it's that gal. I put her to sleep. Oh, I got thick hips because my bottom half is going to be a pony, but my top half is not. And I need time to fully accept one another. True words. <laughs> what? What is going on? Why? Why? What is happening? Ugh. Oh. Oh. My brain is like so fried. I I don't feel like I could even make toast right now. The <laughs> what? Oh, 
Okay, so now we need gods to destroy the old earth. You need powerful enough to rule a planet. Okay. Do they have a new writer, like, every five minutes? Did they just take, like, 30 different people, give them all drugs, and just say, write a story, and we're just going to push them? We're not even going to make them connect. We'll just we'll just put in a new one every, every level. Maybe. Maybe what that's it. Maybe that's it. Meanwhile, I have a guitar solo. Okay, so now I'm destroying a planet. I'm destroying the Earth. Oh, okay. This makes sense. <laughs> what the bleeding... I'm destroying the Earth. That's my boss. I have to destroy planet Earth. Okay. Uh... This is... Very odd. I honestly, Roman Catholicism and Scientology makes more sense than this. I would sooner be a Mormon and actually know what's going on than make this game make sense. Magic underpants? Doesn't seem so weird right now. Gotta say. You know, Adam and Eve doesn't seem very weird right now. Actually, it seems to make a lot more sense than this. Mimicry versus Earth? So we made a fake planet? Is that what's going on? Maybe. I just know that planet Earth is hurting more. Oh, so there's two Earths fighting. So it's not that I'm dying, it's that the planet's dead. Oh, I don't think I'm going to be able to finish this level. I think I'm going to have to call it quits. I mean, I'll yeah. keep trying. I'll wait for you to catch up. But yeah, I don't 14 think, credits. I don't think I'm going to figure it out. This is too complicated. destroy the mimic earth only it's impossible using lock-on, um, but I probably should, honestly. Um, so I can switch between lock-on and non-lock-on by hitting the A button, and it changes the color of the reticle or the shape of the reticle. And I'm using, see, this is lock-on. You probably can't hear it, 
because you're listening to Darren's audio, but it's going like beep, beep, beep. But I switched to lock on, and I think this might actually what have you done to might actually be pretty good advice. Let's put her to sleep is all. Why are you yeah. Is anyone watching my screen may feeling. not understand what look is going on because I Apple barely do. But um, that's why you look that way. Basically, my health doesn't deplete Obviously, because I'm really good at dodging. Closer. But the but health bar at the bottom of the screen gets effed up pretty quick. That can't be open yet. So we need more time to that's the problem. I'm trying to like drop the health bar at the top of the screen faster than. But you're using us then as the health bar at the bottom. Goal in mind. The health bar at the bottom uh -huh. just keeps going you're down. Because I'm not very we'll good. Be on the front line. I mean, I got this far, it's but. Useless. And it's okay until this point. That's at this point, better. it gets really bad. Is this what works on you? What is going on? Mm, Saki? Can you hold on to my heart? <laughs> Can you hold on to my heart? Yeah, just hold my heart for me, will you? And I died again. Oh, okay. Thanks for the advice, Brian. I er, didn't mean to dox you. Thanks for the advice, Wii Machine. Um, that'll probably really help. And we'll, we'll switch it off. I mean, maybe this is the final boss. Could be. Open Dyson. Kill the pretty hard. I take its place? She's becoming the new planet? I am so confused. <laughs> and I'm going to be the god of war? Yeah, isn't this a game? She's just replacing the earth? Will she lead all humanity away? Is anybody getting this? for me all that matter. I appreciate uh, you guys going out there helping me figure out how to um, how to get past the boss, but uh, unfortunately, I'm just not good enough. I don't think it's gonna happen. This is like my fifth try, and uh, well, maybe I'll get it. You know what? Let me try just just the, the confusion. And never really being super sure what you're doing. I gotta build up sometimes. But check it out, Darren. Isn't this like good entertainment? Like uh, we're both at the same boss now. It is. Regardless of what happened. There we are. So you gotta sword those green balls. Wii Machine is your fan. He's telling me that you are nailing it. Yeah, I feel like I'm doing pretty good right now. Mm -hmm. Looks like we have a challenge. I won. 
Wow! Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. What did you do? I just, uh, I barely moved and I just aimed at the shit. Don't bother with sorting, because if you just hit it with, like, your gun, it fires back. Oh, really? Yeah. Killed by the very people oh, that's helpful. Bed. Where's Archie? She's gone, but she dragged us into it right up to the end. Yeah, those you got a sword though. Japan's a mess. <laughs> what are we gonna Japan's do now? No argument. When I was little, I always wanted to be a cop. <laughs> you think they'd hire what? me now? <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna go be a cop now. After yeah, all this. They would. You could kill all the ruffians yourself. Not by myself, I couldn't. I'd need you to protect me. <laughs> Wanna take them on? Together? Let's do it. At least that way we can have some fun. All right, I did it. Whew. Enemies. Title Last Soldier. Wow. So what we did wow, beat we it. beat the game? We beat we it. Beat the game. <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Well, 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 well. Ooh, we did it. We faced our sin and punishment. So, <laughs> since we've already suffered sin and punishment, there is no time for rug rides. We we have already done the sin and punishment. Um, wow, that's pretty cool—a completion in under two hours. Yeah, yeah. And uh, I am left with more questions than answers. <laughs> yeah, it's uh, man, that that was a that was a that was a story. Mm -hmm. <laughs> things, and might I? Yes, <laughs> I. This is gonna this is gonna give me a lot of a lot to think about. You know. Yeah. And also. Uh, for competition-wise, folks, it doesn't get better than that. Um, I had a definitive lead, and I think I might even have a better score. But then the last minute in the clinch, Darren pulls ahead and beats the Fang Dang whole game. Yeah, just yeah. A mere, a mere what? Like 80 seconds before me? <laughs> yeah, just barely. Just barely beat you. Well, congrats, yeah, man. That was, uh, that was really good. Yeah, yeah, I can't, uh, I can't believe I did it. I was uh, that that stage before the final boss there was just uh, really kicking my ass. I was like, I don't even know if I'm gonna get to where Brandon is, but I eked it, I eked it out in the end. <laughs> we sure did. Wow. Uh, what was your favorite part? Was it? Well, you tell me. What was your favorite part of the game? 
Um... I don't know, it's very... Th this game was like a, th a thrill a second, man. It was like, it did not slow down. It was just like, shit going on. Boom, 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 boom. I don't know. It was just, it was overall just a, a good, a good time, I would say. Even like, look at the dialogue still on my screen. Saki, uh -huh. always the optimist and so carefree too. And <laughs> it's the reason I feel at ease. It's so bright and warm. Am I in the womb? Yeah, I think you're like riding inside the monster form of the guy. The little like light is maybe his consciousness. Oh, wow. What a game. So it says clear time, one hour, nine minutes, 30 seconds. I guess that's the time when you're not like dead. So that's kind of cool. Yeah. Well, let's see here. You got a score of 1,493,117. Child. Child. Creepy. 2000 Nintendo. Nintendo 2000. Let me pick up my controller. Hey, and you got more points than me. I only got 1.1. 1. 1. Oh, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. But my clear time was one minute faster. Yeah, one minute thirty faster. seconds faster. Yeah, interesting, interesting. Well, what do you give this game? I give this game five. Five. Seriously? Yeah. Five out of five. Five out of five. A game this screwed up? Yeah. Wow. Who cares? Who cares about how messed up the story is? It, that was the the story is just there to give you something to laugh at while you cool down between all the awesome action. Wow! 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 Oh my gosh, that's a lot for me to process. I wasn't expecting to taste it today, but um, oh man, okay. The music is good. It's really fun. I. I'm frustrated and I have no idea what is going on, but that's good. A little culture shock is fun. Ooh, I don't think I can give it a five out of five, though. I don't know. A five out of five is a hall of elites. It's um, it's a sacred realm, and should I let some turds go in there? I could just ruin it for everything else. <laughs> this is not a turd. You're you're right. You're exactly right. Ten years after this game came out, I bought the sequel for Wii on sale for four ninety nine. I bet you it was a good deal, Brian. That's probably probably worth your time. Um. Oh shit! I'm probably gonna regret this, but I give this game five out of five. Blam! It was a good time. It's just really fun, and uh, don't judge me, but I might play it again. Yeah, yeah. I wonder. There's, so we played it on easy, easy, normal. Oh, there is no hard. Normal yeah, is maybe hard. you unlock the hard after you finish normal. So, like, look, I just, I, just, I, I, I wanna. I'm not, gonna, I'm not taking it back, but I just want to say, like, don't buy this game. Um, it is a fun time. It's a good game, but like, you can play the whole thing through in like two hours. And it's like a two hours well spent, but it's not like, it's not like replayability like times a hundred. It, it's just, if you're a busy adult who's only got two hours to spend playing video games, you won't go wrong. This is actually really fun. Yeah, this is a, uh, this is a good time. I mean, yeah, I mean, I think the, the replayability would be one of those, like, if you're one of those people that care about score, right? Mm -hmm. You're like, I yeah. can't, I'm not. I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna finish this in one life. I'm not using any credits. I'm getting the most score. Are you one of those guys, Darren? Uh, no. <laughs> no, neither am I. Neither am I. Um, okay. Well, uh, gosh, I guess that's probably it. Do you have anything else to mention, friend? 
Uh, no, that is that is it. So I want to thank Hello, everyone for tuning in tonight, <laughs> and we hope to see you in the future. This is true. All right. Thanks for tuning in, everyone, and we hope to. Why did you see say you in that? The future. Why did you say that twice, Darren? Uh, from now on, I'm just gonna cut your audio when you mess with me like that. I have that power. You uh, know that. No, 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 no. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in, everyone. Ahem. Cut. No one can hear you now, Brandon. <laughs> to you. I think I might have messed that up. Yeah, you did. <laughs> but no one heard it because I cut your audio, so I guess you come out looking okay. Oh, nice, nice. <laughs> Uh, do you want to say my line? Uh, well, no, you're back, so you can say your line if you want. I won't. All right. Well, goodbye, everyone. <laughs> Brandon's been a spoil sport. Bye. <laughs> <laughs>